Hi, I'm Mary Flower, and I'm here thanks to Elixir Strings. And uh, I just have a little exercise, an unusual little piece in drop D tuning uh, that fits nicely into a 12-bar blues progression. And I hope you enjoy it. And let me walk you through, let's kind of take a look at the different parts. You're going to have a muted bass, and it starts on the four chord, which in the key of A is a D. So you're low D, muted, monotonic bass. I'm muting with the heel of my hand. That's going to be the first four measures of the 12 bar blues. Then back to the A. And back to the D. It's a little slower than that. And then back to the A. When it's time for the five chord or the E, I'm going to use my thumb here. And uh, of course, you could also, it doesn't really matter. You can, if you don't like thumb wraps, you can pull that finger over. And then back to A. So that's our bass part for the whole song. Um, here's the interesting part, and that is. It's going to be your melody that goes along with um, uh, everything but the five chord. So. Slide in there. Try that with me nice and slowly. Ready, and. And then there's this little filler part. Little hammer on. So in order for that hammer on to last, I keep that finger down and bring my index over to the third string. So here's that whole section. You're gonna do this uh, every time there is a D chord. Ready, and. over or uh, uh, second finger and you can use any of these notes so these these two notes whatever you want to do with those two notes so I do something like this Interim licks. Uh -huh. Last time we're going to play nice and slow through this. Two, three, four. the tune uh, do whatever you wish with it but it's it's a beautiful little tune to play and sounds kind of dark and foreboding and uh, drop D tuning remember in the key of A starting on the four chord those are the three unusual things about this tune so I hope you enjoyed playing it and thanks again to Elixir for having me 
here to play and teach you a tune. Hi, I'm Mary Flower and I'm here thanks to Elixir Strings.